Hello. All right, we are back. So if you watched earlier, I did a Costco. I'm just, I'm just, ugh, slide on the side. We did a Costco haul video earlier. Then we put it all away, and I said I'd come back and show you what we got at Fresh Time. Um, so, but if you didn't see the first one and you're watching this on YouTube, come join me on Instagram for Hearts at Home, and it's where we do the videos live. And I will post my handle in the description. And if you missed the Costco haul that we did a little while ago, you can see some of the stuff back there. Um, if you, you know what, I'm gonna turn those because I'm wondering if they'll play like something. <laughs> they shouldn't, but you never know. Mm -hmm. Well, Instagram and YouTube have weird things. Anyways, so we did a Costco haul earlier. Now we're doing our fresh time one. And I'm going to tell you what we're gonna have for meals for the week, so actually let me grab that. Um, so we were going to have chicken and steak on the grill today but they are still completely frozen solid and since we're just getting home and unloading stuff I just decided we were going to have pizza. We were going to do that on Saturday but I'm just going to move meals around. So tomorrow we are going to do the grilled steak and chicken, um, grilled steak with chicken thighs, cucumber salad and oven fries and fruits and then um, Monday, no I'm sorry that's tomorrow's Monday. So then Tuesday we will have slow cooker barbecue beef sandwiches, roasted potatoes, corn, and fruit. And then Wednesday, I'm kind of bumping them all down so I'm making sure I get it right. Wednesday we'll do cashew chicken stir fry with rice and fruit. Thursday Asian chicken wraps with fruit and chips. Um, Friday we will do, actually Friday they will all be on their own because I'm going to be at a homeschool conference. And I'm going to dinner with my friends. So Friday they're on their own. Well, so for the yeah. Yes, but dad, dad and brother. Will. And then Saturday we'll do chicken and cheese quesadillas oh, with I rice want a pizza down. and fruit. So I, pizza I have to shift Saturday. everything. Anyway, so that's what we're doing. That's our meal plan. I always share it when I do our fresh time hauls. So okay, let's not do that because you might rip the bag open. So I got a big bag of yeah, raw broccoli. I've kind of been craving a broccoli salad, so I think that's what I'm going to do with some of this. It'll also go well with um, the cashew chicken, so. Is that why you got cashews? I didn't end up getting cashews. I'm going to have to get them at a different store. Okay, so broccoli. Milk. Yes. Because we're almost out. Yes, so we got actually two things of milk. Yep, they're in there somewhere. All right, what's next? Oh, there's one more of these. Yeah. So, Fresh Time and Notoriously always has their little coupons for $2 off, things like this, or 50 cents off of individual yogurts. And they do it on things that they say are going to expire soon, but these ones are good till June 18th. These ones are good till June 4th, and these ones are good till June 10th. So, besides the June 4th ones, which is still quite a bit of ways, um, these you can also freeze. So I, I actually don't ever buy them full price because there's always coupons on them. So you can freeze these as well. We got heaven, he, heavy. <laughs> yep, heavy whipping cream. So I just like to have this on hand. My kids love whipped cream on their pancakes. So I try to always keep heavy whipping cream on hand. Yogurt. Yes. So we got two of the strawberry. And two of the peach. Of the peach. My son picked out the strawberry and my daughter picked out the peach. So these will often have 50 cent off coupons. They didn't have any on them today. But I grabbed these two and we will freeze them. And they work really good for smoothies as well. We got some sushi. Oh yeah, don't tip it. <laughs> It'll go all over. Sushi. Sushi, yeah. So whenever I go, I get my husband a sushi um, for him to have at work the next day. So I picked him up a sushi. And he got Hershey's chocolate milk. Yep, that was Wyatt's pick. So my son really, really wanted this Hershey's chocolate milk. So I said we could get it. It's A2A2, but it's still Hershey's. Um, so it does have other stuff in it, but that's okay. It's a treat. 
avocado oil honey barbecue chips. Yeah. And avocado oil malt vinegar and sea salt. Yeah. These ones are really good. They are. So the Boulder Canyon brand um, has a few chips that um, are made in avocado oil. So I do appreciate that as opposed to some of the other oils that chips can be made in. So I got these to go with our Asian chicken wraps. Um, bread. Yes. So my son eats a peanut butter Nutella sandwich every day that he goes for his IEP services at his school. And so this is the bread he likes. This is the bread I buy. It, he does peanut butter Nutella sandwiches. He has the same lunch every single time. Eggs. Yes, be very careful with those. I know. <laughs> so we really like these eggs. They have a really rich yolk. Um, and they are free range eggs. So grab those. We got another heavy whipping cream. And we got organic half and half. Yeah, just another backup coffee creamer. Also, I like to add a splash of this when I make our oatmeal. Um, so I just like to have half and half on hand. Blueberries. They had, yep, they had their blueberries on sale, two for six. They're conventional. They are not organic. Um, but they had no blueberries at Costco. So. Another milk. Oh, there's one more. Okay, so every time I go to Fresh Time, I try to get a homeopathic remedy to um, restock or keep our, yeah, we do need to, keep our medicine cabinet stocked with good homeopathic remedies. I like this brand. I am not sure how you pronounce it. It's B-O-I-R-O-N. Um, and I was noticing that we had gone through some of these, and so we needed some more. Um this one is indoor outdoor allergy relief. You also have a bunch um, of like one, like only one. Yeah, that's what this one is. Um, this is for kids. They're really neat little tubes. You can kind of see that in the picture here. And actually, um, you can grab that one. Um, this one, so yeah, this one is for itchy and watery eyes, sneezing, itchy throat, and nose. This one is for cold relief, sneezy, runny Wait, nose, and nasal congestion. Dry. Um, okay, so yeah, I got another one of these. This one is cold, cough and cold relief. So she kind of started with a little bit of nasal stuff and I'm not sure what it is. So we did this this morning. Um, it's basically homeopathic elderberry. So this is a single ingredient homeopathic remedy um but they're really kind of neat so i'll actually show you you want to do it right now okay so they they don't all come like this but a lot of the single ones do so it's a little tube like this and it tells you how to take it there we go i don't know what happened we got paused maybe i lost internet anyways this one is um Adults and children at the onset of symptoms dissolve five pellets under the tongue three times a day. So this one, some of them you take like every 15 minutes for the first hour, but you just take the tube and you spin it. One, two, three, four, five. And then they just come out in the little lid and then you just pop them under the tongue. Under the tongue. So then they this one dissolve. is supposed to relieve cough, laryngitis, and rhin rhinic, whatever. I stuff you know. I can't. And they don't taste bad. <laughs> so they're made in France. So anyways, we got another one of those and then a few other homeopathic remedies. And they tell you what ages um, you can use them. So anyways, that one's that. So I got three different ones just to restock our medicine cabinet. Organic brown sugar. Mm -hmm. So, oh, I just grabbed another thing of brown sugar. You can absolutely make your own brown sugar using um, cane sugar and molasses, there we go. But it is nice just to have it on mm -hmm. hand. Yep, that's what it is. Oh, that is <laughs> so I just grabbed one of these. I already have 
brown sugar, but just continuing to stack. And I like this one because it is a product of the USA. A lot of sugars are not. Have you done it before? I have not made it, but I know you can. Flaxy meal. So in the stacking up, um, being prepared, um, I grabbed, we do not need this right now, but I just grabbed it to throw in our pantry um, to some whole ground flaxseed meal. So you can add this to essentially anything, pretty much any baked good. You can add it to your oatmeal, you can add it to your smoothies, whatever you want to do it. Um, you can also buy the whole flaxseed and grind it yourself. Um, I, don't, I don't do that, maybe someday I will. But you do want it ground when you ingest it because that's how you get the nutrients. Our body doesn't break it down if it's like in its whole form is what I've been told. But we really, um, I shouldn't say we like it because you don't really taste it. It's just an added nutrient to it. And you can also use it as an egg replacer. So um, once you open it, you should keep it in the refrigerator, which is where my current one is. But I grabbed another one just to throw in the pantry. Oh, Wait, is that how you say it? Yeah. Yep. And so I got, on the, again, this is something I don't need right now, but we put these in our protein balls, and so I thought I would just get another one. This one's good till 2024. Um, after you open it again, keep it in the fridge or the freezer. And these are just, we like these in our um, protein balls. So again, just put away. Oh, did I get two brown sugars? More brown sugar. <laughs> and then milk powder so we have milk powder already but i grabbed another one just to put away again being that the world is the way that it is right now this is a great thing to keep in your pantry it's good till 2024 so not a crazy long shelf life but long enough to get us through if we were to run out of milk and it wasn't available to us but i also really like to put this in our oatmeal and it makes it very very creamy they would do that in like a store-bought packet would come with some milk powder so we like to add that in there and it makes it creamy oh i forgot about those i'm excited to yeah try. they sound delicious i don't know what they're <laughs> there um so skinny dipped almonds these are strawberry lemonade i am very excited these are for me mm -hmm. um, very Wait. you can try them but i'm excited <laughs> they were a little snack for me Lettuce. Wait, does this come with spinach in it too? No, this one has just green butter and red leaf lettuce. So we really like this lettuce. It's a Minnesota grown lettuce. And so we like to buy this. It's um, grown clean. They don't use any herbicides or, <laughs> herbicides or pesticides. Um, they were on sale two for five, so we'll use these in our wraps, but then also just to have um, for salads. My daughter loves salads. I love. We got for it got peanut butter. Yeah, so this um <laughs> there we go. Um this is the peanut butter if you watched our Costco haul earlier. Um this is the peanut butter that we typically eat on like a daily basis and I showed you that I got some of Costco's peanut butter because this one did not work very well on our protein balls and I don't know if it's cuz it's a little more liquidy. Um it's just dry roasted organic peanuts and sea salt would it's exactly what's in the Costco one. But this is a little runnier, so it did not work well in our protein balls. But I grabbed another one of these to throw in the pantry for our storage. Um, we go through one of these every week to two weeks. As I said, my son eats a peanut butter and Nutella sandwich like three days a week. I, I like peanut butter and apples. Yeah. They do a lot of peanut butter and apples, um, peanut butter on our rice cakes. So grabbed another one of those, and these I wash up and actually reuse the glass for food storage. Baking powder. I needed some more baking powder. This one, as far as I know, is aluminum free. Doesn't have it listed. I was trying to get some from Azure, but you can't find it, so it's like gone. <laughs> so I grabbed one of these because I'm almost out of baking powder. This good. Are you gonna make these into something? Uh, I just got them for the sandwiches. And then I picked up two things of deli meat. We don't need a ton of deli meat, but it is nice to have on hand. And I like. Yeah, Fresh Time has a really good deli. So I got some of their Fresh Time honey ham. This one is nitrate free. I did just a half a pound of that. And then um, Boar's Head teriyaki chicken. It looks 
Does look good. So we just grab these. Hand My up. husband can make sandwiches if we don't have leftovers. Mm -hmm. You can put this on top of a salad. Or I can just, just eat whatever. It. They both smell good. Or I can I'm not a huge it. fan of yeah, they smell really um, good. deli ham, but the chicken mm -hmm. smells good. That's actually why I got it because I thought it looked good. Um, orange mango lemonade. I've never heard of mango or, or organic, not orange. <laughs> that yes. So she saw this the last time we were walking out the door and really wanted it. So I said today when we went there that she could get it. Um, we've never tried their... Um, lemonade. Yeah. So... I've never heard of mango lemonade. Yeah. It's not terrible. I mean, obviously there's some preservative in it because it's a shelf-stable thing. But we grabbed that because she wanted to try it. I don't know what this is. Some kind of meat. Chicken. Chicken. Yes, like this chicken. is for the cashew chicken. So I really like this brand of chicken. It's called Farmer Focus, and it is organic and free range. Um, it is expensive. They had it on sale today, but there was not much there. Um, no antibiotics ever hatched, raised, and harvested in the U.S. and humanely raised. So, um, anyways, this will be work because. It will be like chicken with veggies over rice, so we can use that rice to spread the meat. Um, the prices being the way that they are, you gotta get creative in ways to spread your meat costs. So this will just go in to the fridge and I will use that um, chicken for the cashew chicken. And it might be that I have to rearrange my meals a little bit. When I bought this, I was intending on using it. Mama, can I show um, you the mango lemonade? Not right now. Um, this was going to be Tuesday, so I thought if I bought it today, it would be fine, and now it might be Wednesday. I don't know. Anyways, if I don't use it right away, I'll freeze it. Okay. We got the, we already opened them because they're delicious. We got these lemon zest, I don't know how to say that. It's Madeline's. They had a 50 cent off sticker. The kids each got to pick out a bakery treat, and this is what she Those picked. are delicious. They are good. I ate like three, and they're, they're good till tomorrow. I ate five of That's why they had a coupon tomorrow. on them, as they expire tomorrow. It's fine. Okay. We'll end up and then eating them all. My son picked out some chocolate mini donuts, so when kids come with, they end up getting to pick treats Can out. Can I have the rest of those since they don't go expired? No, you're not Can I have a little more? No. They don't expire. And then these were, again, oh, yeah, those are totally delicious. for me. I got... Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Strawberry champagne, dark chocolate, truffle, and sea salt caramel with milk chocolate. Um, I've only these tried chocolates this one, are but really, this good. One's really good. Yeah, they're fresh time um, market, and they are no artificial flavors, colors, preservatives, or trans fat, and they use fair trade certified ingredients. So, grab both of those. But that is it. That is everything we got today at Fresh Time. So if you missed the Costco haul and you want to see that, you can go back to the previous video. But now I get to put all this away and I'm, I'm tired. <laughs> Taking on both stores with the kids was a lot today, especially because Costco was busy. It wasn't insane. I've seen it busier, but it was too busy for my liking. I don't usually go shopping on the weekend like that, but got to do what you got to do sometimes. So, all right. Well, you guys have a great evening and God bless. Bye. Bye.